Yeah, I think we're in a very good point as a band. Good moment in time. You know, we've like, been doing it for over 10 years now. Um, we're making more music than we've ever made before. So that's something we're doing something right. You know, you know when, we, when we write music, it's, it's just the influence of the four of us. You know, we, we have different musical influences, different things we want to write, different things we want to do within the band, and they all come out in their various ways. And we end up with this like smorgasbord of different sounds. And, yeah, there's not too much consideration behind it. You know what I mean? It's not, it's not like pre-planned that we're going to be like, we're going to make this song this and this song heavy and this, it's just kind of whatever, whatever comes out. Can I explain that? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, yeah, I don't know about the, everyone's always saying that about albums and it's like, I feel like there was like a period maybe like five years ago where everyone was saying the album's going to die and everyone's just going to release singles and now, five years later, people are releasing double albums and it's like, you know, it's like, it's, 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 it's much better now and I think everyone's come back around to the idea of the fact that if you're an artist and you make an album it gives you much more room to, to breathe and to develop and, and express yourself rather than if you're just releasing singles the whole time. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it seems like there's a bit of a resurgence of, um, of kind of punk and indie, um, which is great, yeah. Especially, yeah, lots of young bands, yeah. I think the first album was pretty influential to like a generate like some people in, in a generation of bands and it's like occasionally you'll like hear a band play live or like maybe listen to the radio and you'll hear something you'll be like that's pretty pretty similar <laughs> well, i don't know yeah i mean what well, it's i guess we won't really start writing the next album until like a couple of years time so let's see what's going on there maybe there'll be nothing left maybe it'll be impossible to write an album because there's no electricity <laughs> you know? or just no studios or you know, no people left who knows yeah, no musicians maybe they're all the musicians will be killed you know in the great artistic purges of 2021 i don't know who, who fucking knows yeah we have like like today we just went and uh, had a nice lunch in the center you know tapas which was delicious and last time we had a bit more time so we went to the guggenheim and walked around yeah it's it's really nice here yeah I think there's definitely like a period of time where it's really exciting. You know, like it's always exciting to go to a new country, for example, or, or like, well, like one you haven't been to for a long time, like Japan, for example, we went back to this year for the first time in like five years. But uh, there's definitely like, I think maybe after like six months, you lose your energy and it's a good time to stop. And, and you know, and so it doesn't stop becoming exciting, you know, and then just then do it again. Yeah, I mean, it's great to be able to travel around and see all these places.